Hi, I'm Toby, and this is the Eggplant Auto Complete Interview. Oh, I should be holding this up, shouldn't I? Let's see how that goes. Okay, how does Toby feel about riding a horse? <laughs> okay, um, I feel sorry for the horse. Um, how would I feel about riding a horse? Well, I'm a bit of a control freak, so I'm not sure I like to be sitting on something that can run off into the distance without me controlling it. So I think an iron horse is much more what I want to be on, with a throttle, a brake cable, and then I'm in control. If you really want to know about riding a horse, ask my wife and daughter. Okay, number two. How does Toby describe the perfect customer. Um, someone that is visionary, wants to change, is continuously improving what they do. Someone that cares about their own customers, the customer experience um, they're driving, the journeys their customer are on when they're touching multiple facets of an engagement with an environment, um, you know, multiple products being able to be similar in the same way that we use them and experience them. So it's hugely important as we move more to that digital age, as our kids start to grow up, that the customers we work with are very much focused on the outcome of a customer experience journey as they move forward. Okay. How does Toby feel about his first few months at Eggplant? Um, really, really positively, actually. Um, I think it's a fantastic company with some really great people. Uh, it's had you know, huge growth over the last few years in terms of the market expansion it's been on. But I think the great bit about being in here is the ability to change and innovate. Um, Eggplant is, is full of people that want to actually make a difference in the market. Um, want to serve our customers fantastically and provide the most the, the best service we can as we're driving that out in terms of the sales and the propositions we're taking to them when we're delivering. So one of my big focuses at the moment as well when I'm working with the sales organisation is, is to ensure that we've got a, a very much a customer centric kind of point of view in terms of the value we deliver. So working very hard with the teams at the moment to make sure we're on the front foot in terms of business value, our value outcome selling approaches as well, um, to ensure that we don't just can, you know, service the customers well today, but we service them best in the future as well.